Henry epitomizes the meaning of the word mentor. He was such an endearing person, and for someone of his accomplishments and someone of, of his stature, he had an unbelievably friendly, disarming approach to people. Dr. Bowman will forever be remembered as one of the finest surgeons that this world has ever known. Through his tireless efforts as an internationally renowned spine surgeon and teacher, Dr. Henry H. Bowman has earned his reputation as a university hospital's distinguished physician. After earning his medical degree at the University of Maryland, Dr. Henry Bowman became a resident at Johns Hopkins Hospital, where his father was an acclaimed pioneer in hip replacements. There, he conducted federally funded spine research, which supported the anterior or frontal approach that he would later become famous for perfecting. After serving in the Air Force as a major, Dr. Bowman came to university hospitals and the Case Western Reserve University School of Medicine in 1972 and greatly enhanced the legacy of our nationally recognized orthopedics department with his new procedures. Well, I think there are many reasons why University Hospital and our Spine Center is unique. Number one, it's the people that count and their training background and I would say talent and experience. And obviously it's the patient that benefits, I think, from all of this. It's easy to say that, that no single surgeon has done more to revolutionize the way we practice spine surgery and the, and the way we take care of patients with spine injuries than Henry Bowman. Not only was he a superb practitioner, but he was an innovator and someone who believed in research and the culture of discovery. And he pioneered any number of techniques uh, that had have revolutionized spine surgery. Dr. Bowman spread his revolutionary approaches to surgery throughout the world, publishing more than 120 journal articles and 45 book chapters. His spine fellowships became one of the most desired training opportunities in medicine and would become a source of great pride for Henry Bowman. We've had 75 spine fellows in 35 years, and I usually select folks that are be going into academics because I want to plant my seed in other institutions. And it, it turns out to be the right decision because they have published over 2,000 papers in peer-reviewed journals. His commitment to excellence will be carried on for generations. He has taught the teachers and that becomes uh, a, a long-standing uh, legacy. Henry was a giant and continues to be and always will be a giant in everyone's mind who had the great opportunity to know him, to train with him, uh, to work with him, and to be cared for by him. For the approximately 300 procedures he performed each year, Dr. Bowman's patients ranged from local residents to royalty, such as the ambassador to Saudi Arabia, Prince Bandar bin Sultan, and great athletes such as Baseball Hall of Famer Cal Ripken. We operated on him in 1996 and he got back to playing his last year and a half. It was worth six million dollars and I never saw a red cent. <laughs> but he did great. Of course, Dr. Bowman's spine fellows learned that he was also an enophile, an expert in fine wines. Henry would have all the residents over to his house for a five or six hour dinner. And during that time, he would lecture to them on the various wines and grapes and wine making. And many of his spine fellows uh, also are now collectors of wine. So it became a very expensive fellowship. Henry's spine fellows so appreciated his training in orthopedics and wine connoisseurship that they annually celebrated with the Henry Bowman Wine and Spine Dinner and along with Dr. Marcus, helped raise more than $2 million to endow the Dr. Henry H. Bowman Chair in Spine Surgery in 2008, of which Henry became its first holder. We had the dedication in San Francisco at a wine and spine dinner, and it was one of the few times that I actually saw Dr. Bowman uh, become very tearful in, I think, really realizing uh, 
how we all felt about him. This is one of the best known, highly respected, and well-liked spine surgeons in the United States and by many measures the world. And yet he himself was humbled by the fact that we were giving him tonight's honor and this special recognition. Tonight we honor the late Dr. Henry H. Bowman for a lifetime of unsurpassed achievements in his field with the University Hospital's Distinguished Physician Award. It's our honor tonight to recognize Henry Bowman, a physician, a leader, a mentor, and our friend. Henry, we will miss you. Henry was a consummate gentleman, a great scholar, and you should all be enormously proud of his accomplishments. He was uniquely talented, and one of the very finest people I have ever known. No one is more deserving of the University Hospital's Distinguished Physician Award. Henry Bowman spread the reputation of this medical center worldwide. Henry, we really miss you.